So, uh, Bob Bryant got away? I knew I'd never find him in South America. What about the other killer? Yeah, you kind of glossed over that one. Well, I found Jim not long after my showdown with Ringo. At the time, he was riding with the James Younger gang. Did I neglect to mention that? Jesse James? The greatest outlaw who ever lived? Jesse and his kin rolled with Quantrill when he raided Lawrence, Kansas and killed near 200 people, boy. Ah, nothing great about that. And from there, him and his brother went on to rob banks and trains from Kansas to Missouri. Which is why there was such a rich bounty on their heads. Forty grand for both of them, dead or alive. That's one hell of a payday. I confronted them as they were robbing a train. Bullets were flying at me from every which way. But I knew I'd have to fight my way forward if I was going to find this gym. I shot that first one in the face. that now, now, now wait a second now, how'd they stop this train in the first place well the James boys were experts at this oh is this the scene a freight train having heard there was a big payroll in the express safe so i hopped the same train i didn't know it was gonna be one of those i thought i was gonna have to shoot What's up? that's fine i want a mulligan anyways the james younger gang was decimated after that little fiasco they had in Northfield, Minnesota. So Jesse needed more men and took on the killer I was after, along with a host of others. More pumpkins! I was hoping to find my man and put a bullet in his head. Alright, just making sure. What is with the pumpkins? Train. I must have swallowed a hundred damn bugs before I the reached James that. Younger gang pulled the first train robbery west of the Mississippi. Sounds like you hold them in high regard. Everyone knows they were the most famous outlaw gang ever. And you took them all on by your lonesome. Again. I'm finding this all a little hard to swallow, friend. Oh. Well, maybe you need to wash it down with some whiskey. By the way, did I mention that that train was flying down those tracks like a bat out of hell? Where is it? Go back and get it on the other side.
I'll take you back. <laughs> I'm gonna say him out. Do do do. Jesse James, you better not be hanging any photos up there. I'm gonna kill you. Um. Thought I could get away. Better move. I'm trying to kill the person behind you. I think about your dynamite. snake well i've had more than a few drinks and uh, i've been sitting here for quite a spell <laughs> right through there let me show you so much malarkey in my life. Uh, you think he's bullshitting us? You don't think he's Silas Greaves? I think he's just some old drunk looking for some free liquor. Hmm. <laughs> I gotta admit, the story is not as fun without him not around. Huh? I don't know, Jack. I think I believe him. Am I just you going through the same train Boy, over and over? Kid me. That story makes no sense at all. Jack. I mean, you gotta be two bricks short of a load to believe that cock and bull story. I don't agree. Jack, lay off the boat. But you seriously think that tired old man went toe to toe with Jesse James? Huh? <laughs> well, that's better. Come back. Did I mention that this Jim was married to the infamous Bell Star? Of course, I didn't learn that until later. Anyway. I made my way forward the best I could. Around the sides, over the roof. I fucking love this game. Oh no. I think I think I back fuck this game. At some point some some bitch saw me and shouted out, it's a damn Pinkerton's. <laughs> now I never worked for that Limey kind of stuff. But I guess they assumed I was one of his assassins. Those evil bastards firebombed Jesse's mother's house and killed his stepbrother. So it's no wonder each and every asshole on that train wanted me dead. Everybody's always mistaking it for somebody else, aren't they? Why is that, I wonder? Don't rightly know, Jack. I'm just telling you how I remember it. I bet you are. Thanks for shouting. What's going on, on the other side? Fuck him. I look 
think it was going from the other side, but what was the other thing you said? Oh no shit, it's just a train. It's one of so many places I can be. Some bitch. I came across a flat car piled high with logs and had to come up with a creative way to make my way forward. So naturally, I died. I never would have saw that coming. Did I shoot the chains? I wondered if I was ever going to find the front of that train, or the bastard I was after. Jesse hired a damn army after Northfield. Guess he didn't want to be outgunned like that ever again. Another right Gatlinger. Was attacked by some asshole on a Gatling gun. Yeah, seems like you run into a lot of them. Uh, yeah, he does. Did nothing but hurt me. It was that goddamn easy the whole time. Wasted all that dynamite. There's an awful lot of weaponry on this train before I get to the engine. I don't think I like the energy that they created in this room. Looking for Jim and shooting any son of a bitch stupid enough to get in my way. So I was gonna jump out. And that included Jesse James himself. <laughs> I shot that second dude. Full of iron. Oh shit, when the fuck did I pick up these dumbass lamats? Where'd my grave go?
Trying to trick me. There sure were a lot of men determined to die that day. Excuse me, sir. It was then that Jesse detached the express car from the rest of the damn train. Was I supposed to move? I don't know I can move. Jesse waiting for me, fixing to kill me so he could get away with all that money. Some of that money. Ah, shit. You had a showdown with Jesse James? Of course he didn't. Everybody knows that Jesse was killed by Bob Ford. Yeah, Jesse went out like John Wesley Harden. Coward shot him in the back of the head. Guess it doesn't matter how far you run, does it, Ben? Your past always catches up with you. Yeah, I didn't kill Jesse James. Just wounded him bad enough to convince him to hang up his guns. What about that Jim fella? What happened to him? I figure he was up front with a gun to the engineer's head. That bastard slipped away again. I'll tell you how I got it, but first I need to whip my whistle. 